respect yourself and forget her. If you're in a relationship, especially if you're in a relationship, and she's doing things to disrespect you, like being unfaithful, entertaining other men, putting herself in situations that she shouldn't be in that makes you look, I guess, kind of like a fool, be able to move on. Don't stay in that situation, especially if you try to work things out and fix them. Because there's always a possibility that things can be fixed with certain things, right? When you set boundaries, and if she respects you enough, she will she will gladly not cross those. But also you, you gotta be able to do the same. You can't you can't just expect all these things and then be on some bullshit. But that's where this the main thing with that is being honest, man. I don't think you should be out here sleeping around but if you're honest with your intentions and they're for it then it's better than just being a bitch and not saying nothing and going behind their backs and all but I still don't think you should be out here doing all that but respect yourself and not just in the sense of a relationship man respect yourself when it comes to finding potential or a potential new girlfriend give you an example of mine that I really just had to think about for real and actually no not even right now it just came to my mind though cause like it just comes and goes as you know I go went for a little drive and I just be thinking and look there's a girl and I was interested in her but then I, she didn't really see me in that way right and she has the right to see me however she she does right it's not to say nothing about that but look she told me about she would be she would tell me like oh this guy's cute or like da, 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 da. to my face bro and in the moment I hear that shit I'm like bro what the fuck like I don't give a fuck you know what I'm saying but that's just like my little ego in practice I'm like bro I fuck with you and now you saying all that bullshit but in the moment I'm like yeah bro I'm not interested in her no more but then she would come back and talk to me and then again I would like I wouldn't say like fall in love you know what I mean because I like she's pretty and I, I liked her. And then she would say some stupid shit like that again. And then I'm like, yeah, never mind. But then she would come back again. And then I'm sitting there hoping, like, one day, what? Like, she's going to fucking be like, oh, I think you're cute. Like, bro, what the fuck? I got to respect myself enough, bro. She out here, she fuck with somebody? Cool. Every right to do so. But why the fuck am I sitting here trying to wait for her to fucking come and fuck with me when I'm already fucking with myself? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how you got to really think about this shit. <laughs> Cause don't get me wrong, yeah, she's cool and all, but bro, what the fuck I want to be second choice for? That's not how this thing works, man. One or none, one or done. Respect yourself enough to see yourself as one. Don't settle for a two. Don't settle for three. But be honest with yourself. Don't settle for that, but also know this. I wasn't one. I wasn't pick one, but I'm working towards becoming that, right? But that's where you find the weakness when you're not number one yet and you're still working on yourself, still developing. You will either allow yourself to be placed number two because you don't feel like you're worth or you don't feel... Like, you can achieve number one. But you can, man. It takes work. takes time. But you are the one. So don't disrespect yourself by allowing a woman to treat you as anything less than that. And respect yourself in so many different ways, man. Don't go out here just giving out your freaking seed to all these random girls. Value that, man. You're worth more than a fucking hookup. Especially if you're just trying to... If you hook up with anything, man. Don't be doing that. Take care.